Hi guys, welcome back to Football Manager. Um, there's only going to be two episodes, uh, two episodes, two matches in today's episode. Um, I'm not feeling particularly well. Great. I'm, I'm feeling a bit rough actually. Um, I don't know what it is. Just feeling very, very ill. But today's matches, it's a, it's a big episode. We've got Barcelona at home in the Champions League, and then Rangers at home in the Premiership. Um, two big games. So let's go straight into the Barcelona match. Uh, in the last episode, we had a pretty dire run of things. Uh, should we go with the, we'll go with the beast tactic? This one. We'll take a quick pick. Just get the best players on, uh, or the best available players, according to the, to the manager. Um, so yeah, I'm just I'm not feeling overly peaky. I don't want a second goalkeeper unless I've got um, Bastoni. Actually, I'd rather Brown than Bastoni. I think. No, I'd rather Brown than Target. There we go. Yeah, I, I don't know what it is. I've had a, a long day. I, I was working. I've done some recordings already. Um, I was going to put this off, but I don't know when I'm next going to have time. So I need to get this recorded, really. I don't really want to let... I, I, I know the recordings for Football Manager have slowed down massively, but it's a case of uh, working, finding the time, getting pissed off at the fact that the, uh, the computer is a little bit, well, rough. And apparently I'm hitting overloaded encoding again. At 6.6% CPU usage. That's the other thing as well. I'm struggling with this computer. Um, I, I've mentioned before I have got things on the way. So let's continue to opposition. Going in strong on Neymar would be effective. Um, if we can get near him. Same as Messi. And they got they got Neymar. Bernardeschi. Where is Messi? They're not even playing Messi. they still got Messi. I want to have a look. I want to go, let's go, we have to do it a long way around while it's being sparse owner. Um players. They have got Messi, he's just injured. It's fortunate for us. 31 at the minute, so Suarez is still there, he's 31. They've got Sam and Nazari for some reason. Um, it's all by position, isn't it? Neymar, obviously. Federico Bernadeschi. Well, not bad. Busquets is still there. Iniesta is still there. Okay. Um... Gerard Piquet is still there. So you know it's going to be it's going to be a strong team. We know that it's, uh, it's just Barcelona. So we'll apply that advice to the teams. Continue to team talk. We we'll expect them to pick up where they left off last time out, and they, they seem happy. Oh, I have faith in you. Go out there and make a difference. I have faith in you. Go out there and make a difference. And I do apologise. It's um, as I say, I don't feel 100 percent i don't even feel 80 percent. i don't even feel 60 percent today i'm just feeling real sort of uh run down but yeah as i was saying earlier I, I, i've been slowing down the recordings for managers it's um it's just having the time to do it i mean because i'm working to pay off the computer parts i've bought to actually increase the amount of things plus the fact we've got this issue with the recording which keeps telling i've got encoding issues i don't know why um yeah, it's just it's, it's it's just trying to. I mean, fucking around with the settings on this recording so much, and it is basically because my computer is old. Henderson nearly got a goal there for us. That would have been. Oh, can you imagine Celtic beating Barcelona? That'd be amazing. That'd be absolutely amazing. It's it's my dream to beat Barcelona in this match. It's not a very sort of like big dream, but. You know, it's 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 a dream. We've all got to have dreams. Mine is to beat Barcelona at the minute, and then Rangers. I mean, that'd be a great episode if we could beat both Rangers and Barcelona. Oh, here we go! Fucking yes! It's cheered me up a little bit. I'm back up to like 65 percent decent feeling. I've got a cup of tea here because, as we all know, cups of tea are healing, not just for the soul but for the body too. And they've got a dominant possession, but we've had more shots. You see what I mean here as well. This computer just struggles to load. Um, it's a good goal, that. Good finish. I'm not going to say that. The goalkeeper could have done more. But So who else is in our group? Tottenham and SLB. That's the other match to watch down there. So Ericsson scored for Tottenham. They're 1-0 up. Um, let's nick that ball off Neymar. Let's go. Oh. Lovely, just about just about cleared that. We need a draw from Tottenham and uh, Benfica, and obviously a win here. 
I do want to get through to the uh, knockout stages. I don't think we're, obviously we're not going to win the Champions League, but getting through to knockout stages will provide us a nice chunk of money for next season. Um, I am looking to stay here probably two seasons before we move on to a new club. I've not been at a club longer than a season. Obviously, we stayed at Magdeburg for a season. Um, that seems like forever ago now. It's a goal. <sighs> yeah, it seems like forever ago now. It was quite a long time ago that I was recording the uh, Magdeburg episodes, actually. But, I say, just life. <laughs> life gets in the way. I'm 24 hours overtime last week. I'm doing 18 hours. There we go. It's a goal. Fucking Luis Suarez. Cunt. Who's he bitten? Um... Yeah, done 24 hours overtime last week. Doing, I can't remember if it's 18 or 20 this week. Um, doing another 20 next week. And that's a, it's a lot of overtime to be doing. And I'm just getting a bit tired and run down. But I need to do it. There's stuff I need to do. So, Let's have a crack, have a crack. Goalkeeper. I was about to say the goalkeeper's out of position. Have a crack. But. The Tottenham is still 1-0. I mean, I would take a draw with Barcelona. I mean, it massively reduces our chances of... Uh, Going through to qualify uh, to the knockout stages, but I'll take a draw against Barcelona. It, it'll make me feel a bit more confident about uh, what you call uh, Rangers. So I think we need a team talk, a little team talk, just before half time, and it's a show some passion team talk. It's a good first half, more of the same. My phone is going off. Um, Happy with performance so far. Keep it up. Uh, you weren't that bad, but you can still improve. I'm passionate you weren't that bad, but you can still improve. Won't worry about it in the last two. Um, so, yeah. And one will draw. Barcelona. I take it. We haven't even got a decent goalkeeper in at the minute. We've got two decent goal... Well, got one decent goalkeeper and one semi-decent goalkeeper, but they're both injured. Tottenham are 2-0 up. And I'm fully expecting this this group to be Barcelona top with Tottenham second. Uh, Stewart about to get sent off. He is, isn't he? Fuck. All right, so that's Stewart sent off. We're going to have to bring a attacking midfielder back. So let's bring Salza. Saying how is Salza playing? He's got a six point three. So yeah, we got Salza out for. Bastoni. Anyone else not really? Let's get Adger up there. We'll bring Henderson off for uh, Fletcher. That's two subs. I want to leave it like that for the minute. I'm going to bring um, probably Trincao on at some point. Let's have a look. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Seven assertive. I have faith in you. And. I think there's a lot more to come from you. You looked happy. Felt he gets along well with the manager. So I'm glad Darren Fletcher feels like he gets on well with us. Now, with a man down, I really do want us to just draw. We're not going to. That's a goal. Oh, my my happiness and the way I feel has just dropped down below 50%. <laughs> I am. I do feel fucking rough as arseholes. And arseholes are rough. There's no such thing as a smooth arsehole. Unless, of course, you have like multiple enemies. At any, I don't even need to talk about it. Some people watching this are probably eating their dinner while they're watching it. I don't really want to be talking about enemies. You know, those things that go up your ass and wash you out. And free one. So this is it now is dog shit. So it really is like having it. Oh, it's disallowed. I still like getting an enemy, though. I feel like I'm getting fucked. How's that dinner going? Uh, so, yeah... It's this oh, is going to be a drubbing, isn't it? Let's get a team talking. Let's go with a passionate push forward. Because although we've got a man less, we need to do something. We need to try and attack. I don't care if it needs to leave. Yeah, he's left us in lurch. We need to be careful now. We're losing. We kind of need to push. We need to do everything we can to push forward and get a goal back. Anyone playing poorly? Anyone completely fucking knackered? Near Burton's knackered. Let's get uh, Trincao on for Dembele. Trincao does score a few for us, doesn't he? I mean, Dembele scores a few for us as well, but... I like I like the fact that Trincao just... It's not even his position. does well in it. We've had more shots in Barcelona, so there's some positives to take from that. 
I was about to say fairly similar possession, but it's not. They've got 10% more possession than we have. This is a goal. Still had more shots than them. Can we get that ball? Push it forward. Adger. There you go. Trinkau's there. Trinkau's there. Little one over the top. Trinkau's offside. Neymar's so quick. Full time. That's 2 1 loss. I mean, I was expecting a lot worse. Um, obviously, Kevin Stewart didn't really help us out. But uh, what can you do? But well, we are sitting bottom of the league. Tottenham and Barcelona sitting first and second. That is disappointing. But Stewart's been banned for one match. I'm just going to issue him a warning for being a fucking idiot. And he accepts his warning. That's fine. But the next match is against Rangers. Now, we desperately need to win this. We desperately need to win this. Um, in fact, winning this is more important to me than winning the fucking league. It's Rangers for fuck's sake. You know, it's Celtic Rangers. It's one of the biggest matches in the world. Um, uh, no comment. I'm not even talking about the fucking Scottish national team. I don't care about the Scottish national team. No one cares about the Scottish national team. Apart from Scots. But even then, I think most of those guys are either indifferent. If you are Scottish and you're watching, how do you feel about the Scottish national team? Are you indifferent? Or is it only when you play England that you really care? <laughs> and, uh, I find that tends to be the case. Um, no, 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 no. He's staying transfer listed. Yeah, he's staying transfer listed. Sorry. Don't want him. Got no business being transfer listed. Yeah, he has. So I put him there. So Christian Gamboa is going to go. So that's someone off the transfer, transfer budget. That's fine. So he goes off in January. That's 1.2 million to add to our transfer key. Um, I am going to try and get a couple of signings uh, when it comes to that time of year. So what we'll do, actually, we'll have a quick look at... Um, see if there's any more on the youth intake. See if there's been any new... There's been some. Where's this? Tunisia. It's North Africa. So... Benfica de Luanda. So Angolan. I mean, they've clearly been sort of. We'll scout a couple of people anyway. Let's get a couple of scout reports going on. Um, you never know. Might be someone decent. Benfica de la Bagana. These. Does Benfica just have like a lot of fucking. like toes and pies, you know? Just They've got a couple of clubs here in Angola by the looks of things. So this is clearly the Angolan intake. New star. Is this Angola? Cameroon. I don't know who the big teams in Cameroon are, to be honest. Um, in fact, I don't recognise any of these teams. I don't recognise any of these teams. I'm assuming these are all going to be very small teams. But I would like to maybe just take a, a pot. Uh, a pot? A pop. Uh, just a couple of guys, like Gail... Nzana sounds like he could be I don't know how he sounds like he'd be good Junior Mbaya why not Edmar Capotco I'm hoping he's going to be good and Osvaldo Pacavira I'm looking for someone with a decent name actually I'm hoping that someone is going to be someone with a decent name who's going to be really fucking good that is, that's what we're going to look at now we're not even going to look at anything else we're going to see see the names DJ Khalid Tal well, I don't know about DJ Khalid uh Mohamed Reda Dubusha, no. Mohamed Taibi. Was there a Mohamed Taibi already? Is there a famous footballer for, or ex famous footballer called Mohamed Taibi? I know there's a Massimo Taibi, wasn't there? Was there a Mohamed Taibi? Frank Okono. I like his name. I don't know why. Um, Arsen Aka. African Sports. Eric Bakayoko. John Marcone. Ibrahim Diara. Been a lot of good footballers with the name DR, isn't there? So that's what I'm hoping for. I'm going for him because, well, I can't pronounce his name. Abdelkrim Ben Abdelkader. How was that? If you are, um, 
Algerian. How did I do with that pronunciation? <laughs> did I murder it? I'm sure I murdered it. Uh, let's Didier Insami. That sounds like that sounds like a superstar name, doesn't it? Didier Insami. Uh, Osvaldo Pacavira. We're already looking at him. Zhao Quimbamba. We're already looking at him. See, that's the thing, isn't it? When you do this, it's just like there doesn't really seem much um, in the way of options here because I'm not too sure about where they're from. Sao Tome. What's going? <laughs> just fuck it. Why not? We could have a world class Sao Tome on our team. Well, we will check the uh, youth intakes from time to time. We might check it again next week. It may be a different youth intake. You never know. Uh, Robbie Nelson seems a bit overawed by the sense of the occasion going into the match. How are we looking to capitalise on the mental state? I found his comment surprising. Yeah. You seem very confident about your own ability to handle pressure. I don't let himself get carried to. Uh, yeah, whatever. That'll do. I don't really care. I don't want to get involved too much in the whole fucking anger with Rangers. Well, I will question his desire because that's the kind of man I am. It's not actually. I don't question anyone's desire. <laughs> I mean, if your desire is to sit in a vat of manure and wank, then I mean, maybe I would question that. But I mean, it's your life. You can do what you want. As long as it doesn't affect me or anyone else around you, it's it's fine. Do what you want to do. Do it in the privacy of your own home, except, you know, make sure you're very good at cleaning before you do. <laughs> don't, know don't know what I'm doing. Uh, Gaspar Luandas dos Santos. They don't reckon he's going to be any good. Not going to be any good. Not any good. Not any good. No good. Might be worth keeping an eye on his development. Okay, we'll have a look at Junior and Beer. Uh, not worthwhile, not worthwhile. Bear in mind, I know the scouting here is very minimal. Um, we'll have a look at Arsene Acker. I like the fact that Arsene Acker is a potential decent player. Uh, Ashley Young's been assigned to look for talent in China. But, but Ashley Young's a terrible scout. He's a terrible, well, he's not a terrible player, but I don't want him anymore. Let's go to the team selection then. I'm going to go quick pick it. Actually, no, I don't know. Diego Alves. I don't really want Diego Alves in the team if he's not, like, fit. I mean, I want him in the team, but I don't want him to be, like, there if he's not ready. Let's take Ewan O'Connell out for... That's only because he can cover the left. We've got any right side. We've got two people who can play on the right. We've got two people on the plan. We've got more than two people on the left. Trincao, Griffiths. Do we really need three strikers? We'll take Apcom. Apcom. Akpom off. We'll replace him with Scott Brown or Lee Chong Yong. Lee Chong Yong. Lee Chong Yong. I don't know why I like saying that name. I actually quite do enjoy saying that name. And that'll do. Now, this is the big one. This is bigger than Barcelona for me. Um, and I'm desperate to win this one. I look. I just seen my face in the face cam. Do I always look this fucked? Because I feel this fucked. Um. Aberdeen have played a game more than us, and they're five points clear. If we win this one, we can go within two points. And it also means we can pull three points clear against a head of Rangers, who are on the same amount of points as us. We are the favourites. I don't know what their team is like. I mean, is that a good team? Who knows? Uh, we'll let Danny McGrain apply his team to it. No, we won't. We'll, we'll go to Dub Dub. We'll let Dub Dub do his thing. Uh, we're, today is about the supporters. We owed Rangers after what happened in the last match. So I have faith in you. Uh, passionate, I have faith in you. And assertive, I'm expecting to see quality finishing. There we go. <sighs> it's my old, my first old firm derby. Actually, I think it's my first old farm derby, old farm, old firm derby ever in Football Manager, like in the history of Football Manager. Me playing Football Manager. And I've been playing for a while. I'm not brilliant at it, but I have been playing for a long while. Um. I've never ever played in, in Scotland. This is my first time. But getting a win here against Rangers will really make me happy. It might get me back up to like 70% on the uh, on the feeling good meter. It's a nice steal there. 
So can we get them on the break? Sal's just going to... Can he put a long ball in over the top? There we go, like so. Dembele at the keeper. At the keeper. All that space, all that time. And at the keeper. Alfonso looked like he wanted that there. So we've got more possession than we've got 60%. They've got 40. We've only had two shots. They've had one. We've got yellow yellow for Kevin Stewart. He's just picking up. I need to have a word of him. He needs to stop picking up cards. He got himself sent off, didn't he? Dembele. Lovely. Lovely, lovely goal. Lovely goal. We're the only match playing today as well, by the looks of things. So, no need to worry about that. That is a beautiful goal, I think. The sun's just come in and it's blinding me on my right fa my right face. I've got two faces. I've got my left face and my right face. Um, no, it's blinding me on the right-hand side of my face. It's really, really not helpful. Um, I would love a dedicated room to do this in, guys, actually. I, I know, obviously, my wife walks back and forth across the background. Um, but I, I, and I would love a dedicated room to do this in, but we just don't have the space in this house. Uh, it's not the biggest house in the world. I mean, it does it us right. Dembele, just roll at him, then mate. Let him get a free save. Um, it's not the biggest house in the world, so I can't really sort of get a dedicated room. It would be nice. You never know. If we move somewhere in the future, I might get a cupboard somewhere. <laughs> An understairs cupboard. I mean, that'd be fine for me. Good goal, Dembele. I mean, you hit it at the keeper and the keeper turned it in, but I mean, it's still a good goal. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I, I want to move. I want to move houses. My wife is quite happy where we are. Um, I want to move somewhere that's further away from the train tracks. <laughs> All I hear, oh, and from people and their dogs that shit in the garden, they don't clean it up. That's the other thing. It's just like you go into what I go into my garden. I'm it's like today is a lovely day. I'm I'm gonna suggest that me and my wife sit in the garden to eat our dinner today. Um, because it's a lovely day, but I know if I go out there, all I'll be able to smell is dog shit, because the neighbours don't clean up after themselves, and that fucks me off massively. They also don't look after their dogs properly. Uh, might have sort of leave that all can change. Um, it's getting a, a passionate, I'm very happy with your efforts. He seems confused. Well, you speak English, don't you? Maybe it's because he's used to hearing English in a Scottish accent, and I'm very, very English. Although I sound slightly Australian, I know. I know... I'm not Australian. I've touched on this before. I'm not Australian. I just sound it. Just very slightly Australian sounding. Right, let's get team talking. Let's get an assertive concentrator. So, yeah, I, I would like to move away from the train tracks, away from the neighbours' shitty dogs that bark all night and shit everywhere. Um, and maybe just find somewhere. It's still enough a free bedroom. It doesn't need to be bigger than this, but has like a an understairs cupboard that I can set myself up in. Maybe have a green screen behind me so you don't get to see all the shit behind me. Be quite nice. Rangers have scored, have they? Fucking joy. That's where, that's where we get FM'd. I know I sound dead, and... Uh, Stuart's just had a goal disallowed as well. Yeah, I know I sound dead. Um, but I really, really need to get this recorded. I don't know where I'm going to do it. But, um... Yeah... Hopefully, it won't be long, we'll get this new computer built, and I'll get these videos back up to 1080p, 60 frames a second, which is what I was recording that originally, I don't know, I've, I need to go back and look at them, and see how bad they were, I don't know if they were terrible or not, I've, I've never reviewed my own videos, I've never reviewed my own videos, Christopher Adge has been sent off, fucking wonderful. So let's get bitten in the centre there. Let's make some subs. We're only 80 second minute. Might as well. Let's get Rogic off for uh, Chong Yong. Uh, let's get Trincao on for Dembele. Should we get Pong Kong? We'll get Pong Kong for Bitten as well. Because he doesn't really get any games, does he? That would do. So yeah, I've never reviewed my videos. I need to go back and check them out, to be honest, at some point. But again, it's just finding the time. And in a minute, I'm just 3-0. I'm happy with 3-0. Because that their goal was disallowed. Yeah, I was just trying to get as much of this out as possible, really. I um, not because I just want to smash it out, but I just want to make sure there's content for the people who are enjoying it. Because um, I do enjoy recording. I just want to make sure that I am doing better. And my intention is, once this new computer is here, I'm going to try and get Adobe Creative Studio and actually do some things properly. 
So I mean, I've got I've got Photoshop, but I'm borrowing kind of. Um, when I say borrowing kind of, I may have borrowed it without paying. If that makes sense. Um, and we won three nil. That was fantastic. I'm going to go over passionate. Well done. Very happy with the result. Um, I am very happy with that result. So we're two points now behind Aberdeen, three points ahead of Rangers, and we beat them in the Old Firm Derby. That was good. And De Bella gets a reward for fine form. So he's on a new contract on 25 grand a week. That's fine. Uh, we're going to give uh, Adja a warning, and he accepted this warning. Gasparini has been watching Mr. De Bella. Well, he's not going, mate. He's not going. Gasparini, Jan Piero Gasparini. You can watch more you want, but he's not going. So yeah, I'm going to try and review my videos at some point, and I'll try and get Creative Studio, and hopefully, I, I would like. I mean, I mentioned it. I don't know if you've been watching my Motorsport Manager series, my newest one, the Ice Mod. It's worth watching. Um, I mentioned I may kill the Crusader Kings two playthrough. Now I know I've killed three playthroughs already since starting this uh, two months ago. I may kill a Crusader Kings 2 playthrough, partly because I'm not enjoying it. It's not really a challenge. Um, but I'm leaving it to a vote. And then if it does, does decide to go, then the intention is to let you guys decide my next playthrough based on the games in my library. Or, if someone's happy to buy me a game, um, that we can play together maybe, or a load of us can play together. So say for example, I don't know someone wants to buy me Battlefield One. Say there's, say there's 15 of, our, of the subscribers or 15 of you guys watching, and you want to play Battlefield One with me, then what we'll try to do is get that sorted out, and then we'll uh, get on Twitch or something, and we'll stream it. We'll have a squad of four, myself and three others, we'll play Battlefield, or we can just do uh, round robins on FIFA, so we can have a best of three. So on and so forth. Anything like that, I don't mind. Just you know, I'll I'll try to do a video at some point. I'll set up a, a poll. Um, yeah, and then we'll see what happens. So if the Crusader Kings two playthrough does die, which it may do, then that will be what we go for. We'll, we'll take it to the vote. And anyway, I'm gonna try and get a little nap before I make a start on dinner. Uh, if you have enjoyed today's episode. Please do like and subscribe. I mean, I, I think today's episode has been... I know we lost to Barcelona. I think today's ep episode has been success, result-wise. Um, but yeah, please do like and subscribe. Check me out on Twitter, at Kegedy, um, to get... Basically, it's, it's to get all the up-to-date videos as they come out. I, I always tweet them on there um, when they come out. So, And I do apologise about the... What, to me, is going to be an obvious lack of quality in this video, because one of the commentary... And two, because the amount of encoding messages I'm getting pop up. But yeah, so I can only apologise about that. But it won't be long. New PC will be here soon, as I say, if you've not seen it. As it's going to be happening soon. It's going to be happening soon. I know the case is coming today. And I think the GTX 1070 is going to be a couple more weeks. So, But yeah, please do like and subscribe. I'll see you when I see you. Bye-bye.